Andrew Tucker, and welcome to Andrew Tucker World. What's going on, all my great people? What's going on, all my boxing fans? Uh, I have some breaking news and also some exclusive information, you know, uh, regarding Anthony Joshua versus Alexander Usyk. I know it's a fight that a lot of us can't wait to see. Uh, one of uh, uh, one of the, one of those highly anticipated matchups, one of those highly anticipated bouts. Um, the first fight was a good, was a great fight. So I know we're looking forward to seeing the fight again. Um, but I, I've I got some exclusive information regarding the fight, according to uh, one of my uh, sources. Uh, uh, and I come across this article uh, today. Um, it says exclusive. New doubts emerge over Anthony Joshua's rematch with Alexander Usyk, as Eddie Hearn faces moving the fight back even further from its original April date, with no contract with no contract signed yet. Um, Anthony Joshua was surprisingly beaten by Alexander Usyk last September. Since then, Usyk has fought on the front line for Ukraine against Russian forces. He will need time to regain the 22 pounds of muscle he had lost while fighting. Uh, this is basically what I'm getting from this article. Um, uh, Anthony Joshua's uh, Anthony Joshua's world heavyweight title rematch with the Ukraine war hero Alexander Usyk will have to be pushed will have to be pushed even deeper into into the summer now i know uh, some people have been reporting on this news have been have probably made videos went live talking about uh this situation regard regarding the anthony joshua versus alexander Usyk rematch uh but it says here anthony joshua's world heavyweight title rematch with ukraine war hero alexander Usyk will have to be pushed even deeper into the summer if contracts are not signed is, are not signed next week so according to this article uh which was released today um a couple hours ago the contract has to be signed next by next week <clears throat> excuse me the contract has to be signed by next week uh so according to the article, Anthony Joshua's world heavyweight title rematch with Ukraine war hero Alexander Usyk will have to be pushed even deeper into the summer if contracts are not signed next week. Um, um, of it also goes on to it also goes on to say of of in the confirmation confirmation of Joshua's bid to regain the multiple belts he lost to former undisputed world cruiserweight champion in a huge but overwhelming upset last September has been delayed again. This will raise doubts about the rematch going ahead in the foreseeable future, especially with Usyk needing time to regain 22 pounds of muscle weight, weight loss while fighting on the front line against Russian forces. But promoter Eddie Hearn insists the fight is definitely going to happen. Um, Anthony Joshua's World Heavyweight Title Rematch uh, with Alexander Usyk has been delayed again. Um, basically, what they're saying: uh, the mega, the mega bucks, the mega bucks fight is still scheduled for one, uh, for one of two new lavish indoor stadia in uh, uh, indoor stadia in Saudi Arabia, one in Riyadh. Um, uh, and I, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly i hope I'm, I'm pronouncing that the correct way if not forgive me please forgive me people in the chat please all my subscribers my my good friends my family all my uk army tucker army you know you guys forgive me if I'm, <laughs> all my people over there in the middle east you know saudi arabia over there in asia whatever y'all you guys forgive me if i'm jacking that that jacking that name up i mean not name but if i'm jacking up that 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 location that area or city or whatever uh, one in Riyadh, the other in Jeddah, the other in Jeddah. So, these are two different um, locations. So it's the it says the mega the mega bucks fight is still scheduled for one of two new lavish indoor stadia in Saudi Arabia, one in Riyadh, uh, Riyadh. I believe that's how you pronounce it. It's spelled R R H Y A D Riyadh. Uh, the other in Jeddah. J-E-D-D-A-H um, Also goes on to say Earn 
Hearn, uh, Hearn adds, we are speeding. Uh, it also goes on to say that uh, uh, Hearn, uh, Eddie Hearn adds, we are speeding up the process, but if we cannot make the official announcement next week, we may have to push back the date, the date further. You know, the timing has already moved from April to May, June, and now to July the 23rd. So that is the target, the, uh, the targeted date uh, now is uh, the date they're looking at now is July the 23rd. Um, and I've heard a few channels, uh, a few people mention that was, the, it's, uh, and it was, and it's been talked about for a minute now, for a while now that uh, it's going to, the fight is going to be held in July. You know what I mean? Um, but I mean, if it's in July, that's cool. I mean, that's right around the corner. I mean, these months going to, the, the next, what, June, we have June next month in July. That's nothing but like uh, two months, two months away. You know what I mean? So, you know, two months, uh, two months and a half away. You know what I mean? So that's, that's like right around the corner. I mean, that's not, that we don't have long until we get to see this fight again. You know, a lot of us ha boxing fans have patience. You know what I'm saying? Long as we're able to get the fight, long as the fight is secured, uh, both fighters have signed the contracts. Uh, uh, everything is uh, pretty much um, a finalized did done deal. You know what I mean? As long as we get the, you know, both fighters have done their job to secure the fight and as long as in the fight get announced, be announced, and it's officially announced that that's the fight is going to take place on that date, then we, we us, us boxing fans, we are, we're happy, we're excited, and we're getting ready for a good battle, a good, and a great fight, and a great event. Um, but, um, it, Hearn also adds, um, we are speeding up the process, but if we cannot make the official announcement next week, we may have to push back the date further. Uh, the timing has already moved from April to May, June, and now July the 23rd. That is agreed. That is the agreed date for us all. That is the agreed date for us all now, says Hearn, Eddie Hearn. If, if needs be, we can hold for another week or two. This is coming from Eddie Hearn. He says, if needs, if needs be, we can hold for another week or two. Um, but if everything, but if everything's not finalized by next week, we won't be able to fit the world media tour into the fighters training camp scheduled. Uh, schedule. I'm sorry. So um, it also goes on to say, but if everything is not finalized by next week, we won't be able to fit the world media tour into the fighters' training camp schedule, and it will be, and it would have, and it would have to go to the 30th or a week or so into August. So we know it could be pushed into August. Um, I hope that they can secure it. Um, I hope that everything you know works out and. July the 23rd be the final, the final, final date. It be finalized for July the 23rd. If it goes into August, it's, I mean, it's, when, if August is not too far away. You know what I mean? And a lot of us have patience. There's some fights we've been waiting for for a year, two years. There's some fights we've been waiting for for like three years. So only a few months away. I mean, we got to have patience, man. I know we really want to see certain fights, but we really have to have patience. Um, but they're they're they they're, they're they're trying they're doing the best they can, I believe, on both ends, both teams, um, managers, um, promoters, whatever, um, promoters, managers, whatever team, promotional company, whatever, all the men in suit, all the businessmen that take care, the the take care of the uh, business part, uh, and con handle the contracts and things of that nature. You know they are looking. They're really trying to just get this fight out of the way, get a get a finalized date so we can move forward. You know what I mean? Um, but it also goes on to say, uh, boxing is also awaiting Joshua to reveal the identity of a new addition to his training camp after promoting An Angel Fernandez over longtime head coach Rob McCracken. In a major shakeup after embarrassing loss to Usyk, uh, Ern, Hearn says, uh, "Expect an experienced new pair of eyes on the team." Uh, so, like, 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 listen, like, I'm really looking forward to this fight. 
you know, I'm looking forward to this fight, and I hope that I hope that the, the person they're talking about is my is our great friend. You know, uh, <laughs> we he's we we call him some of us call him Uncle James. He is Uncle James, but I I call him Coach James. Uh, but Uncle James, you know, you know the legendary trainer James Ali for sure, our great friend, our uncle and the <laughs> coach. You know, uh, uh, you know, hopefully it's him. This that's the guy they're talking about. A guy that knows Usyk very well, that knows his style, is very familiar with his style, that's worked with him for a couple of years, um, helped him prepare for a fight, and just one of the best trainers out there, hands down, one of the best legendary, legendary, legendary trainers to ever do it. You know what I'm saying? So hopefully it's James Ali for sure. But you guys let me know how you feel about this delay. Um, and hopefully we get this fight. You know what I mean? But much love and respect to the UK Army, to Tucker Army, all of my great friends and family, all of my brothers and sisters from different parts of the world, uh, my my special members. Uh, thank you. Thank all of you guys. I want to thank all of my love, all the, all of my uh, supporters, true, true, true supporters that show love and support this channel. Um, uh, I just want to say I appreciate you guys. I thank you guys. Uh, to continue to hit the like button, continue to comment, continue to uh, to, to uh, check your other check your notification so you'll know when a new video is released. But this is basically all I got for you guys right now. But we are looking forward to this fight. I think it's going to be a a a, 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 a great fight, a, a great battle, and I believe the fight will be a done deal. Hopefully, we we get this July twenty third date. Um and um. If it's August, it is what it is. But hopefully, July twenty third is the finalized date, and we get we get a unif a, a rematch and a unification bout, you know, between two skilled elite level great fighters, great warriors, great um uh, great champions. You know what I'm saying? Um, and Alexander Usyk and Anthony Joshua, Andrew Tucker, Andrew Tucker World. I'm out. Much love and respect.